Fake Rich versus Actually Rich How to Tell the Difference If you want to tell the difference between the fake rich and the actually rich, you need to make use of these two scenarios to drive home the point. Your next door neighbor is one who seems very comfortable to you. He's so quick to buy the latest devices, wears all the designers you can think of. He's tall with flawless skin and he walks so confidently and seems not to be bothered by anything going on around him. And of course, he has an excellent job and he has some change to throw around. Or imagine this other situation where you're outside a hotel lobby and this woman with a model-like figure drives in with a new Ferrari. She parks and walks out so majestically to the receptionist. You really cannot stop staring at this point. She must be wealthy, you think. The two figures in these last two scenarios are so comfortable handling the latest devices and driving flashy cars. But are they wealthy? Are they fake rich or actually rich? I mean, how can you tell the difference? We live in a world where living for social media is a real thing. There's a lot of fake posturing going on, mostly aimed at influencing the thoughts of people and making them think that they have the most perfect life you can imagine. But how can you tell the difference between someone who's actually rich and someone who's only pretending to be rich? Because let's face it, just about anyone can look. With the right credit card and attitude, we can all look quote unquote rich. So, in today's video, we're going to share with you tips you can use to spot a fake rich person and also identify an actual wealthy person. But before I continue with this video, I have a simple question for you guys. Do you want to be rich? If you do, give this video a thumbs up. If not, that's okay, you can give us a dislike. So, this video is broken into two parts. The first part will be about the five signs of the fake rich, and the second part will talk about the five signs of the actually rich. So, let's get started. Sign number one, they talk about money a lot. This may not be surprising at all, as the fake rich don't have the money people think they have in the first place. A person is most likely to talk about what dominates their thoughts. When a fake rich person is part of any conversation, he or she will most likely go on and on about what they have and own, and their latest purchase. Talking to a fake rich person can be very annoying. Comment below if you know what I mean. Their lives only revolve around the idea of money, as if that's all there is. Wealthy folks seldom talk about money. Most of the time, they're on the lookout for smarter people to learn from. Fake rich people are so quick to speak about their financial successes, even without you asking, and you can be sure they will throw everything at you. From how much their shoes cost, to what phone they're rolling with, to the car they drive, where they're living and the parties they go to and so on, are just a few examples of what you may hear. Aside from talking about money, they generally cannot stop talking about the general price of things and how the economy is doing so bad. They will complain about how things have suddenly become expensive, yet when you watch them closely, they still spin frivolously. Number 2. A Constant Need for Validation Fake rich are so quick in seeking the approval of others. They cannot stop worrying about what people think of them. They're always in need of constant validation, and they're in endless awe of people who show them. To the fake rich, everything is about impressing that person they feel is certainly below them in the social system. For them, more time and energy is spent on appearing successful, rather than actually putting in the hard work to be successful. The wealthy class does not bother with what people have to say about them. With them, there's no need to show off on social media. The real deal is if you're making money and you're happy with yourself. There's no need to let the whole world know. Number 3. They use complex titles for their job position this might appear funny, but this is also another way of knowing the difference between a fake rich and an actually rich person. They have the penchant for using complicated titles for the position they hold in a company. Imagine you talking to someone and asking what they do for a living. Then, they tell you they're the director of first impressions in a company instead of replying straight up, I am a receptionist. This is mostly done to appear fancy. They're quick to append the title CEO to their names, even if all they are in charge of is a small to medium scale enterprise. The word spin is useless in the real sense, as many do not care, but the fake rich pride themselves in doing this almost every time. They're busy with finding a complicated title for the job they do, instead of focusing on the job itself to earn the deserved promotions. The wealthy are known to appreciate hard work, rather than sugarcoating it. Number 4. They always want to talk about themselves. This is also another way of knowing the difference between the fake and the actual rich. Fake rich people are quick to jump into conversations they are not invited to most of the time. This is usually a good way of identifying people who are insecure about what they make. You can easily spot this if you watch them whenever they're around anyone experiencing success in any form. 
the fake rich always want the conversation to be about them. People also notice this, and they're quick to be tagged as douchebags. Wealthy people want to know a bit about everything. They want to ask the questions that matter and are always excited to hear people talk about their journey and passion. Number 5. They always brag about the plans they have. The fake rich always want everyone in the room to know about the incredible plans they have, which is guaranteed to bring in millions. To simply put, the possibility of a fake rich person actually going through with their ideas, even if they are good ideas, is very slim. This is mostly due to a lack of self-discipline. The fake rich is the perfect description of all talk and no work. They always have that multi-million dollar plan or idea every other time. While the actual rich are super focused on the future and are so excited about what it has to offer, they know that every great plan takes nothing less than a few years for you to start reaping its benefits, not just a few months. Part 2. Signs of the Actual Rich Number 1. The Rich Are Not Outgoing When it comes to identifying the actual rich, one of the things you'll notice is that they're not outgoing in any way. They don't have anything to prove, so why should they be in our faces? Rich people don't want to be at the center of attention, and this makes them harder to notice. They're not overt in their behavior. A rich person would not seek you out in a room to talk to you. He's probably not that guy handing out his business card to everyone in the room. He's not the guy making the rounds, nor is he the loud-talking guy in the room. Rich people do not have a meet-and-greet agenda or a to-do list. They may be perceived as rude by virtue of this disposition, but wealthy folks are one of the humblest people you can meet, and you can be sure you will not see them trying to suit some schedule. Number 2. They do not wear flashy clothes Many think every rich person is all about the expensive clothes and accessories they own. No, the rich are actually very humble, and although they do own some expensive clothes for important occasions, you'll most likely find them wearing everyday wear. They're simple people and who aren't trying to impress anyone. Even Mark Zuckerberg, the owner of Facebook, is known for his gray t-shirts. This sense of casual dressing shows that the rich are not particularly about setting new trends in fashion. But if you keenly observe the rich, there's always quality in what they choose to wear. Pay keen attention, look closely and you'll notice the sophistication, the comfort and proper fitting of their clothing. The flashy designer logos aren't evident and they tend to wear darker colors. Number 3. The rich only hang out with people who force them to level up. The rich don't make the conversation all about them, nor are they particular about taking the spotlight. Sure, you've heard of the expression, if you're the smartest in the room, then you're probably in the wrong room. Rich folks are all about seeking out those that are smarter than them, people they can learn from readily. Fake rich people, as mentioned earlier, are only concerned about making the spotlight all about themselves. Although this does not in any way mean the rich do not have clicks of their own, they're most likely to connect with people they can learn one or two things from. Number 4. The rich don't care if you've heard of them. People seldom talk about this, but rich people do not live superhuman lives. They live just like ordinary people. Although far from being frugal, most rich people live modestly. The story was once told of an editor who met the superstar the weekend. On meeting him coming out of the elevator in a hotel, the editor was curious as to the meaning of the long chain he wore. The superstar calmly replied, it means Weekend XO, and gently told him to Google it. In contrast, the editor was still confused, as he thought he mentioned that it was the weekend, while he was sure it was a Tuesday. This lends credence to the fact that many wealthy folks are exhausted by the attention they garner whenever they're out, and they try to avoid it as much as possible. They do not want you to fawn over them or ask for an autograph. They're okay with you respecting them and letting them have their way quickly without the unnecessary stares. Number 5. They only want to talk about what they're learning. As it's commonly known, in a bid for the rich to keep getting more productive, they're not always interested in small talk. They only want to talk about what they're currently learning, the ideas that come to them in the course of the work, their experiences and all. Most people think the rich only want to talk about the last yacht they bought or the company they just merged with. No, they seldom talk about that. Their conversations are mostly intellectual rather than practical. Issues that rarely have anything to do with money. They already have lots of it, so no need to be unnecessarily freaked out about it. In conclusion, some of the wealthiest people out there are the humblest people you can meet, as earlier mentioned. The fake rich just want to brag about their small achievements, but with the wealthy comes the actual realization that in the life we live in, there is more to it than lots of money, so they do not feel the need to flaunt it at the faces of anyone. When it comes to spotting the wealthiest person in the room, one very sure thing is that you're not likely to meet them in funky or glitzy gatherings. Focus on yourself and your skill, develop yourself in the best way possible, and the rich will seek you out. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have a comment, leave it below, and I'll gladly reply to it. With that said, thanks again, and I'll see you in the next 